Check the mic and make sure it sound right, boys. Sound right, boy. Let's go and have a look at the view. Sound right, boy. Sound right, boy. Now I'm a Bristol boy, and uh, if you ever ask me about the city of Bristol, I will tell you that I love it. It's so green, it's a, um, an industrial city, a commercial city, it's a family orientated city. It's fantastic for the young and uh, for people who like to go out for a beer and a dance, amazing city. And some spectacular views. Um, I have to say though, the views here, they can be a bit breathtaking from time to time. They don't, uh, we don't have as much green as they do back in uh, Blighty, but what we do have normally is sunshine and sea. I was just about to leave this uh, viewpoint area to get home and have a cup of coffee and a bit of breakfast. And I just noticed this, look at that, they've got a yin and yang there. 
How nice is that? It's the details. Okay, we're leaving the vantage point. Now I need to find my way home from here because I've never been this far up before. Let's have a look see. Well, I can't go that way, so I'm not sure if I can go that way. I can go that way. Well, let's go that way then. There's some beautiful houses in this area. A lot too pricey for me, I must say. Especially the ones uh, facing the coast there with those spectacular views. So this is a place, it's about a 15 minute walk uphill from our house. Um, there's a park up here, but Maria comes up here because they have a market where she buys all her fruit and vegetables every week. And Maria likes her fruit and vegetables, I can tell you that. Um, she spends a small fortune on it. Probably more than she does on meat for me, so. Um, it's a nice little walk up here and this is also the church just behind me I'm afraid I can't show you because I'm driving where Hannah is going to be uh, christened no not christened sorry she's already been christened um, she's gonna have her first communion so that means that she's got something uh, about two years of going to church and doing churchy things. I'm not involved with that. Maria goes to the church and she's taking classes. I don't know why she would need to. Um, she went to Terestiana school and at the time that she went, it was run by nuns, so she should be well and truly religioned up, knowing all the rules and regulations. Uh, anyway, that's another story for another day. We're now coming to the part where I um, normally walk my dogs. And from here you'll also have the coastal view. It is lovely. I quite often come up here and just um, sit with the dogs. And if there's a ship coming in, a big ship coming in, I like to see them uh, being pushed around by those little tugs. I can see the school that I work at from here, I can see the city centre, I can see Caravana's beach. And this road here is a little love haven for the people without their own apartments. If you come up here on a night, all the cars are parked up here and they eating their takeaway, sat there with their boyfriends and girlfriends. Um, it's very romantic. The problem is, there's plenty of litter bins there, but they do insist on just throwing uh, all their stuff on the floor. So. Taxi driver. Ignoring the red light there, the green light, sorry. This little place behind me now is where I go and get my supplies. 
Linda Vista it's called. It's a little convenience store where you can buy anything from chewing gum to getting your face put onto a cushion. They do the lottery in there. They're all rounders really. And uh, the two people, Rosie and Juan, are absolutely lovely. And they speak English. So that's always a bonus. I'll sometimes go there for a spot of breakfast if I've got nothing in the house. Other than fruit and vegetables, which is uh, not my cup of tea. And here we are. Olga, Dulce Olga. Home, sweet home. We're going to park the car, get upstairs. The car is parked. I'm in the garage. Two minutes from home now. Just got to take the lift and then breakfast. I've had some coffee. I remembered that this week. Unlike my long walk to uh, his letters, his letters, El Confidel, it's in the his letters area. Um, so I've had plenty of coffee, so my nerves are pretty good, but now I'm hungry. So without further ado, breakfast it is. <laughs> 